looks like we have another game against the hard team of Pinedale, Wyoming. Now we all know that they are a good team, but how will we defeat them? Defense, defense, defense. That's how we can accomplish our goals today. Uh, coach, what, what kind of defense should we do? Uh, a two, three zone. But coach, they, they can't shoot the three. I don't need your sass, Dunbar. That's why you're at the bench this game. Aw, oh, dang it. So our strategy for this game is to guard the area under this three-point line. But how do we know how much that is? Shut up, Dunbar. How we find out is we find the equation for the line, do 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 and we anti-drive it using the reverse power rule, or whatever you want to call it, do 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 And we find the distance from this line, which is 45 feet, do 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 and we plug that into our equation. Wait a minute. Don't you have to take the equation with plugging in zero and then subtract the next one? Dang it, Dunbar! You don't use zero because it's inconceivable to use because it doesn't even matter. So you just plug in 45 and you add the numbers together and you get 658.7 square feet. And we have five players on this team. So we divide that up equally by five players and each player has to guard 131.7 square feet. So let me get this straight, coach. We all have our own specific 131.7 square feet within the three-point line to guard in this 2-3 zone you're running? Yes, exactly. Everyone except for you, Dunbar, because you're not playing. Aw, oh, man. I'm no good at basketball. Dang it. You're right, Dunbar. You're not good at basketball. Now let's get out there and get sweaty. I'm talking rainforest sweaty. I'm talking swamp sweaty. Let's fill a bathtub full of sweat. And let's go out there and win this ball game! Flint played long and hard, and the Flint Tropics were only down by one point. And with a final free throw and Jackie Moon at the line, who knew what could happen? Let's fill a bathtub full of sweat. 